and welcome back to Italiano, Italiano, Italy. <laughs> I, I know I was going to switch out the maps, but there's been, I've been busy work and stuff like that, and, uh, so my parents last weekend helping out with moving a stove and whatnot, so it's been kind of, uh, kind of busy to get a chance to be on here a whole lot, so still working with this, um, to get the grapes all done, so that's good. Grapes are all in the fermenter, making some vinyl. So we got quite a bit of them. Uh, there's also a update for farm sim, and unfortunately, a lot of things, super strength and stupid little things like that, aren't working right now. Which, whatever. I don't have a problem with it necessarily, but I wasn't sure how well it was going to work out for me today because the way I was trying to work this. But and of course, when I first jumped in here, you know how the the cash takes a little while for it to catch up. It's like, whoa, that's no good. But we got her done, man. Got the grapes finished up. Um, so they're fermenting. Oh, let's check the productions. So we got the flour. Finishing up the last bits of flour. It was full, so I brought some over to the bread. I was going to bring some over to the pasta, but I couldn't pull it out of the thing. There's still some in there, but... So without the super strength, you have to lift it up on that edge, and it was kind of a... Whatever, so... It is what it is, so... <laughs> But either way, it's not too shabby. We're working it, working it. Um, doing more contracts. That's, that's why we're able to lease the equipment, of course. So there's no way I could do this otherwise. So, but uh, throw some wheat down here for now. Um, like I said, I'm gonna I'm gonna check out the other, the new version of this map and update some stuff at, that, at some point here. This this was where all the grapevines were at on this side, and then the field was over where the grapevines were at, so it just kind of flip-flopped. But pretty cool. Check it out. We'll check it out. But, uh, yeah, everything's moving along, so that's a good thing. It's a very good thing. Some of the parts were kind of hit hard to uh, get those grapes. I think we all saw that. It was a little bit rough because of the uh, stinking... Uh, Cause some of those trees are right there, but get this all planted up, and then uh, we'll have some. Well, we got some. We got plenty of bread. We'll have, so that's good. <laughs> so that's a bonus. And then, uh, yeah, we'll have the grapes or the wine. Uh, let's see where we're at. Get on the wine. So wine, yeah. Ooh, we're gonna have to get that wine out of there too pretty soon. It's starting to get filled up. Look at that. Holy cow. I guess we could just sell it directly. I keep forgetting about that part. <laughs> but you don't get near as much for it, so that's the bummer side of it. Oh, that thing was spinning around. <laughs> Do a couple headlands on this, and just go back and forth, get this all planted out. But this would be nice, because we get the wheat from it. We could feed the chickens and whatnot for that part. And then we can also take the straw, give that to the cows and then the pigs once you get to that point if we want to do pigs. Oh, got a little spin maneuver going on there. Sheesh. It's been raining pretty much the whole time, so that's been crazy. Don't have, uh, doesn't affect the grape harvest, so that's good. And obviously with seeding, this is actually not a bad thing for, in real life it's not, because throw some seed down, as long as it's not muddy, mushy, of course, but yeah, you throw some seed down with the rain, gets watered right away, boom. That baby started off. <laughs> I hope I'm right. That's what we used to do when we were kids. I haven't planned to do anything in so long. But <laughs> Anywho, hope everybody's doing well. Um, like I said, we had some animals. We had a few months ago. It was kind of nice. Those are still doing well. We're getting some milk out of the cows. That's a really nice deal. Some manure and some slurry as well, so we'll be able to sell some of that off. Said uh this first couple of years here, or long as hopefully doesn't take much longer. It'll be a little bit tight. My bad for jumping all over it, but hey, you know what? That's what family's for la familia. <laughs> so we're gonna take that and move along with our days. Still beautiful. It's gorgeous. It's so pretty looking out at me. So cool, so cool, oh yeah. 
Get the door. I think I can. 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 Yeah, you got it. Well, there's there's several other contracts too on this map right at this time right now. I mean, there's some just a couple thousand dollar harvest contracts. But see so what the harvest one. I like doing the harvesting ones. See, fertilizing and liming. Oh, actually, they had the lime mod that came out. Like the fertilizing ones, things like that, are pretty cool because the fertilizing, you know, once you're done, you don't have to finish the whole field usually, especially on the bigger ones. You have to do more work for it, but you don't have to do the whole field because it'll stop, uh, you know, for instance, eh, about three quarters, maybe four fifths of the field, depending on what it is. Once you get to that level, you pretty much, it'll, it'll tell you you're completed and you can just stop at that point. And once you complete the contract, it'll, like, auto-fill it in. It's pretty cool. It's PQ. So that part's pretty nice. Especially if you get some of um, fertilizing contracts or, or herbicide even, because you can use one vehicle. So what I'll do is I'll grab the vehicle fill it up or use one vehicle if there's like four or five contracts I'll grab the one vehicle fill it up with what's needed and do as many contracts as I can with that you know same thing with the harvesting ones like I've been doing on here trying to get the grains so we can keep the flower flowing <laughs> so new word flower flow got the flower flow yo <laughs> anyway so with that kind of scenario you know we just keep on getting the the grain contracts so we can keep going with those and some of them actually go to that silo so once that's done with we don't get any extra money for it it just goes directly into stock so that's kind of nice and then we could just produce flour from that we can use that for the bread and the the fresh pasta pasta del andre pasta al dente <laughs> so pretty cool pretty cute I guess the cows don't mind the rain here. I mean, it's September, so it's still pretty warm, I'm sure, but... Yeah, it's about to get super sunny again, but... It's pretty cool. Yeah, enjoying, uh, playing... I mean, I've think about a lot of this week and this last weekend, too. I'm like, man, I get those grapes harvested. It's, it's fun. It's relaxing, you know? And that's the best thing to do is enjoy the game, have some fun with it. It's been a good... But, uh, yeah, I wasn't, like I said, I wasn't sure how this was going to go with the uh, new update, and I got some script mods on here, but, eh, we're, we're working it, working it out. Just can't pick things up like I was hoping for. I have to use auto loader. Yeah, pretty much auto loader or use a forklift to do it, but, well, I guess we got that forklift at the shop. I know that. Little things. Little things that make you go, hmm. <laughs> But, uh, get some more eggs from the chickens because we can't do the, uh, pasta yet. We, we just need some more chicken eggs. Once we get those, we'll be able to get the fresh pasta rolling again, too. But bread's still pumping out. I think we still have some oil from the canola that we had last time we did the harvesting. So all this stuff adds up. So, I mean, we bought the... We bought the productions to do these things, so as long as we keep it rolling, keep it flowing, we'll be good to go. So we'll see. Hopefully it'll be a okay. But other than that, yeah, we're going to keep on planting this field here once it's done. Check on some of the contracts. Maybe go ahead and do a couple of those as well. Again, get some more knocked out. We just want to keep them just enough money to where well, I mean, we would like to get more obviously but if we can at least keep ourselves above water to keep that uh that loan balance covered we'll be all right because we don't want to go negative that because we can't do anything pretty much <laughs> danger danger well we'll finish this all up here and uh we're gonna get it fertilized and throw some uh some fertilizer and uh, um Probably wait until next month to herbicide it. But we'll see uh, where we're at with the wine. We might be able to get some of that sold off. Same with the bread as well. Get some money up and running here and then get this back onto uh, 
more manageable monthly fee instead of this ten to twelve thousand dollars a month thing. Ooh, it's hurtful. <laughs> anyway, we're gonna go ahead and take care of that, and uh, we'll get this all feel finished up, and we'll go from there. So we'll see you in a little bit. All right, so we're back in here. We're gonna take the wine over. Um, unfortunately, we get better price in December or January, but we need the money bad. <laughs> it's not too far off. About a thousand, which sucks. So we're gonna go ahead and go sell this off at the sell point up here. And then we got bread too. We can go ahead and sell that. We're gonna put that too. So we gotta get the bread out of there because it's apparently going. Uh, yeah, where's bread at here? The bread is going haywire as well. It's over full. I forgot how small some of these things are. Same thing. It's better later on, but we gotta get some more going. Because I had to put all the bread into that because the pasta wouldn't, wouldn't work. Oh, it's just the way it's working. Whatever. It is what it is. So. <laughs> Did some contracts. Um, well, we got a contract. We started off so we could lease this trailer, which is the auto load one that we have, which isn't a bad, but it works and it's pretty inexpensive. But the tractor here is actually got two baling, uh, so cotton bale co contracts. So I was like, oh, cool! I'll just lease the equipment, borrow one of the tractors. One of the best ways to do it: just lease the equipment and borrow the stuff for your own thing. Now, harvesting is, of course, that's a... Found that out the hard way, too. I was like, oh, I'm going to get the harvester. Just use that for my own stuff. And nope. It can only be used for blah, blah, blah. I'm like, err. So, but to get away around that, instead of leasing the harvester and header and everything else, if you just lease your own header, especially if you just get a cheap one, you save a lot of money, mainly because the harvesters would cost the most. Unless you use one of those inexpensive mods. That's a little different, but... Oh, yeah, we don't want to go that way. It takes forever. So we'll go down to the little town here. Boom, 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 boom. Yippee-ki. Oh, sniggering wing. So this is our first batch of real wine here. I mean, our, our first batch from our harvest, actually. So that's cool. Pretty stoked about that. But yeah, I couldn't get the flower up in there because of that thing I, I mean before I would just pick it up and throw it up there but eh it's not letting me do it right now so I'm sure there'll be updates for everything of course is how that works out but as of right now I think I gotta go this way don't I okay. uh, 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 uh. Yeah. Oh, and not hit the tree would be amazing <laughs> bubble Yeah, we're going to go ahead and get this stuff sold off, and that would be great. I think we got to go on the outside. We'll find out when we'll get over there. I'm pretty sure we're out here, but... Oof. Should I use JCPs a whole lot? Well, this one's not so bad, but the other ones, the articulating ones are annoying. I don't like... I don't know why. I just don't like them. <laughs> Either way, whatever. So, yay, we're downhill, and uh, we should be able to just dump these... Sell this here. I hope a trigger pulls up because this would suck if it doesn't. My goodness gracious. Okay, that's going to be fun. <laughs> so, yay. I think we're going to have to do a little, oops, a little maneuverability here. It doesn't like that, so I'm going to go ahead and go up on the ramp. Watch this. Don't like it? I would have do it. Mm. Oh, I might try to. I don't know if I'm going to be able to do that. Oh. Dang. Updates are great. Don't get me wrong, I do like them, but boy, when you're in the middle of something, they suck a little bit. <laughs> Bling, the train's coming. Get the hell out of the tracks, what are you saying? <laughs> Anywho. <laughs> I just can't pick this thing up, so that's the sucky part. Not gone. Got to be a way to get up there, right?
I just climbed it right up for the kapow. Look at that. <laughs> and there we go. Woo! Heck yeah. $61,000. I'm surprised this tractor just pulled it up there. I had to get an angle on it to get that wheel on there. Once I got up there, bam. No questions asked. It said, I got you. Oh, there's a... It's just like that. Boom, boom. I don't know why I went backwards, to be honest with you. Well, I got up there a lot easier than that. Oh, almost got it. I don't know if I'm hitting that post. I might be. As long as I keep one wheel there, we're good to go. Generally. Oh, there we are. Bam. And then, bam. Oh, ah, oh, eh, ah, oh, ah. <laughs> this is so much fun. I love it. Actually, I do like it. It's fun. Learning how to get this stuff out and around. But, uh, yeah, I'm going to get the bread. Let's see, where did we say the bread would go to again? Let's take a look at that. Uh, we'll go to the same spot or the whole street. Let's drop it over there. We'll get those sold off. Uh, sell, pay down on some more of that loan again. And then... Uh, just about all we got, man. <laughs> Unfortunately, it's the way it is right now. But we'll, we'll get this taken care of. You know, if we can get like... You know, 50 to 100,000 a month there. Boom, boom, a little bit. Boom, boom, a little bit. Oh, hey... Well, that's fun. Between the car and the side, I don't know which one's worth. Get out of the way, dude! Come on, move! Uh, kids these days. If the car would move, it'd just be fine for all of us, but no, he can't move. Because he's a butthole. So what's butthole in Italian? Is it <laughs> oh, I think we got him out there. Yeah, all right, all right, all right. Bruh, there. What the? You couldn't do that sooner? <laughs> Grief. Yeah, I'm going the wrong way. That's my bad, but. Whatever. Whatever. Still pay attention, bro. T pay attention. <laughs> Smush that poor little Italian car. Boy, this has been a little more of a struggle struggle uh, vibe than a good one. Whoa, hey. It's all right. We got those cotton contracts. I almost forgot what those are. Over 8000 apiece. So that's another 16000 there. Plus whatever comes from the extra cotton. So, so let me take a look at those while I'm thinking about it. Ooh. Wow, there's a bunch of stuff just keeps popping up. Holy crap. Ooh, I might do the weeding ones, too. That's not a bad idea. And I could just... Eh, I don't know. Then I could use the weeder for... I didn't even do my weeding yet, but... Let's see all these harvesting ones. Ooh, 11,000 cotton. Oh, what? Huh? We'll just take another cotton one, then. Dang, I should have kept that. I should have brought that. Got that equipment because I've just got something much smaller. It's alright. We'll get that taken care of. We'll get this all put away, but we got three cotton contracts. Um, oh, jeez, I almost forgot. To... Eight, eight and eleven now, so... All three are cottons. Jeez, that's kind of cool, man. Let's see where we're at on those again. <laughs> Only three cotton, con cotton fields in here. Cotton contracts. Sweet. We got all three of them. It's going to be amazing. Amazing. <laughs> so we got, what, uh, 20, 25, 26,000, 27,000, almost 30 grand on the contracts alone. Plus, we will also get the uh, excess cotton off of those. I like doing that. That's what I like about the harvesting ones. Whatever's left over, you get that crop 
additional, so that's pretty cool. But that'll be very nice. So we'll get this bread taken care of. Uh, we're gonna take it over, sell it off, and uh, go from there. This thing is maxed out, so I have to get this stuff out of here, otherwise it can't produce no more. But yeah, we'll get this out of here and uh, go from there. Um, as you can see, our field here. The wheat. We got some weeds, so we got to get to take care of. Got to get this all plowed out, too, at some point. But right now, mm, don't have the money or time for it. We need to keep on things. Keep things rolling, unfortunately. So, But, yeah, eventually we'll definitely take care of that stuff a little better. And more than likely get a much better yield out of it and everything else, too. So, pretty stoked to be out there, man. Grab that one, and then we've got the other pallet there, and then we should be completed here. And we're good to go. So we just got a little bit of selling going on here. There's not, not a whole lot. I mean, as we go through, you know, got some planting done. We got the sell off the wine, our, our first harvest of wine. More bread here. Oh, come on, grab that sucker. It's not going to let me go grab it. Physically, so let's get on that trailer, bruh. There we go. Alrighty then. <laughs> so we'll go sell this one off, and we'll be good to go on that. So yeah, for us. And I'll get those contracts, those cotton contracts done. Um, like I said, we'll pay down on this loan here. So we 17,000 bread. And was it 2,000 or something like that? So yeah, we should have another 30,000 or something like that. So that's cool. That's cool. cool, cool. And then uh, we'll just wipe that balance down a little bit more. So it should put us over 100,000 easily. And then we'll spend that. Hopefully I'll be able to put $100,000 towards the loan. Knock that down to a little bit less. <laughs> I can't really... <laughs> It doesn't sound like a lot. hundred thousand dollars, yeah! And then you go, like, alpha five million. It's like, ooh. <laughs> I mean, obviously, it's not five million anymore, but still. Probably get on some of these grass contracts would be a good idea. Start selling some of that stuff. Any contract we can get. Like I said, as long as we can keep... So far, we've just been kind of doing contracts to keep us afloat until we get this bills down. Now, as we're progressing on our own products... And our own stuff, but yeah, we'll be able to uh, slow down the contracts. I'm mean, going what, 37 contracts? Th almost 40 contracts, I think it is? On this map alone, which isn't bad. I mean, I was wondering, I almost forgot where the heck I was going. Huh? That would have been bad, Juju. There we go, boom. Oh, yeah, look at that. Oh, yeah, it's going to bring us in a good spot. Cool. 46000 for that. Shoot. Cool. I'm going to turn that back in. We're done there. We're done, son. <laughs> so, yeah, we got 137000 there. And then what are we going to do with the uh, cotton contracts? Once those get completed out, we're going to be golden. So, I'm going to go ahead and take care of those. And we'll go ahead and go from there. But, uh... Yeah, we'll go ahead and get these all worked out and get some process. We got a couple pallets there we can work with. Um, let's go up and check out the olives now. Think about it too. Oops, they're down here. Or sorry, not the olives, but the canola oil. Yeah, we do have some down here. Cool. Ah, just a few pallets. That's a major. Yeah, there's the cotton harvester. Really green. That's why I was hoping to get that. Okay, so how the heck? Whatever. <laughs> so we'll go ahead and take care of that, but uh, we'll go back to our. Here we are. Okay, we'll go ahead and get that all taken care of, and uh, yeah, we'll get the contracts finished up with the cotton and go from there. Thanks for like. Don't forget to like, subscribe, say hello. Let me know how you do. Let me know what's going on in your world. 
Hope you have a great day, morning, night, whatever you got going on while you're watching this. Appreciate you, every single one of you. You're amazing. <laughs> Thank you all again, and uh, we'll catch you next time. Take care, and bye-bye.